Hey guys, it's Alex C with TFP TV, and for today's field trip, we're going to be taking down a Calico Carbine. These are, of course, 9mm carbines that have a very strange, very unique helical magazine design. And they're also roller delayed blowback like an MP5. They are possibly one of the most 80s firearms I know of, but they certainly look interesting. They just really are kind of notorious for being unreliable. I don't think I've ever gotten through an entire magazine without some sort of malfunction. And I've tried all sorts of different things. Um, they do come with a 100 round magazine, or if you're into low capacity firearms, a pathetic 50 round magazine. You have to wind the big one 23 times, and you have to wind the small one 10 times, which is a real pain. To release the magazine, press these tabs located on both sides of the gun and it will come off there. And like I said, that is a 100 round magazine. It's also quite heavy and very cumbersome. I imagine it would be very uncomfortable to carry a full loadout. And go ahead and check the chamber, make sure there's nothing in there. And it looks like we're good to go. Now everything starts with this pin located towards the front of the lower receiver. Go ahead and push that out and it is not captive, so make sure you don't lose it. It's a push pin that's a lot like an HK push pin. That'll allow you to slide the forend right off there, exposing the barrel, the charging handle, and the spring that makes the charging handle go back forward. You can also then pull off the lower grip frame. And these are striker fired, unlike an MP5. So you can see kind of that mechanism there that would normally release the striker. So pulling out the bolt and carrier, just pull it back a little bit by grabbing the front and then pull up and out once it gets to that recessed section of the receiver. And there you can see the bolt head along with the rollers and everything. Uh, very MP5-like in that it's a 9mm roller delayed blowback carbine, but unlike an MP5, it doesn't work. So there you go, a field-stripped Calico carbine. The pistols field-stripped the same way. These are really interesting firearms. I would like nothing more, though, than for them to be extremely reliable because running through 100 rounds of... 9mm in one go would be pretty cool, especially if you had a um, select fire version. I, I know the company's still technically in business, but I don't think they manufacture the subguns anymore. I find it unlikely that anyone would adopt these, <laughs> given that they are kind of goofy. But big thanks to Ventura Munitions for helping us out with our shooting videos, guys. And we hope to see you next time.